Hi, and welcome to the Styles tutorial. This quick video is going to go over how to switch to managing the styles on your site, where to go to set up a new template, to change your header image, where to upload a logo, and where to apply custom CSS. Now, all of this is done on your site itself, not through the admin menu. All you have to do to get there is up here at the top right, click Live Site, and you can switch to either Edit Widgets or Manage Styles. Edit Widgets is another video, so we will go with Managing Styles. Now, by default, a site has an active style and then the option to create a new style. This is an inactive style that I've created that I can apply to my site at any time, but is just sitting in the background. It doesn't affect anything, it just shows how my site could look. So I'm going to go ahead and look at that test template. Now from here you can change your template which is the structure of the site, whether it's three columns in Rook or Pawn, whether it's two columns as it is in Bishop. I personally prefer Bishop, but if you want to change to another template just click the uh, button to the left and if you like the look of it, keep the change. If you don't, just undo it and you'll be fine. Now at this point, you'll notice that there's uh, save all changes and discard all changes. If you make a change that you end up not liking later, until you save all the changes on a new style, it is not applied to your site. So this is a preview and not actually being applied until you actively both save the changes and actively make it the style if it's not your style uh, active style already. You can also change the header image which is this image here. So click change header and you can either pick one of the ones that we've set or you can upload a custom one here. So we'll go ahead and pick this one. We'll keep the change. If you want to change the logo, you can go here. And in addition to changing whatever logo image you upload, you can change where it's positioned on the site. So whether it's uh, in the middle of the sword or on the right or wherever you'd like it. To go back at any time, just click the style options button or the top button here. You can also change colors. So just depending on what colors are on the wheel, just click, 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 find one you like. Keep that change. And if you're on a premium site or higher, you can also use custom CSS to change anything that isn't currently in these options. And that is all there is to it. Once you've saved it, once you've gotten it everything the way you like, just make the style active and it is live on your site. If you have any questions, let us know. Send us an email at support at gamerlaunch.com or check out our support forums at support.guildlaunch.com. Thank you.